In this video, you will learn how to conduct a performance review for an employee. First, let's look at how an employee can complete their self-review. Log in as the employee and go to performance, then manage reviews, then my reviews. You will be navigated to the my review list, which lists all your current and past reviews. This shows a summary of your review, such as your name, due date, review period, job title, review status, and evaluation status. Choose the review you need to evaluate and click on the employee name link. This opens the employee evaluation form. The employee evaluation form shows the review details, individual evaluation status, evaluation by each reviewer, and the final rating of the review. The review details shows the employee name, job title, department, review period, review due date, and status. The individual evaluation status shows all reviewers, reviewer type, and the status of each review. You can leave your evaluation off yourself in the Evaluation by Employee section. It shows you the list of KPIs that are added for evaluation, minimum, and maximum rating for each KPI. Rate yourself against the available KPIs by giving a numerical rating within the given scale. You can justify your rating by elaborating in the comment section. If you wish to add any additional comments, you can add it as a general comment. While you are evaluating the review, you can save your progress by clicking the Save button. This allows you to come back and complete the rest from where you left off in the review. You can leave out some of the KPIs and comments if you do not wish to evaluate them, but it recommends you to complete the review by rating all given KPIs. When you're done, select the Complete button to finish your self-review. You will be required to confirm the actions since once a review is completed, it will be marked as read only, where you cannot make any further changes. Once confirmed, you can see the review status of your review updates as completed in the Individual Evaluation Status panel. Now that the employee is done with the self-review, next let's have a look at how the supervisor conducts the evaluation of their employee. To do this, let's log in as a supervisor. Then go to Performance, then Manage Reviews, and finally Review List. The list shows you all appraisals where you are an evaluator of. Following details will be shown for each review appearing in the list. Employee name, due date, review period, job title of the employee, department assigned to the employee, status of the review, and an action link to go inside the review. You can filter the list to locate the review that you are looking for. It is possible to filter the list by employee name, job title, review status, review period, start and end date, and department. Once you locate the review, click on Evaluate to go into the Administrator Evaluation Form Review. You will be able to see the Review Detail and Evaluation Status panel in the top section of the Administrator Evaluation Form as well as the evaluation by employee, which is also listed in this form. You will have a separate section as Evaluation by Supervisor. Completing the evaluation as a supervisor is similar to how it's done by the employee. Once you're done evaluating against all given KPIs, you should specify the final comment. rating in the finalization section. Update the completed date as well, since all the fields in the finalization section are mandatory. When you're done with the review, click on Complete to submit the review. Click OK on the confirmation pop-up to complete the review. The review is read only once it's completed. In the Individual Evaluation Status panel, you can see all the reviews now updated as completed. In addition, the review status will also be changed to Approved, which you can see under the Review Details panel. 
Thank you for watching the video. If you have any further questions, please feel free to reach us at info at orangehrm.com. For other matters, you may directly email our support at ossupport at orangehrm.com or visit our website at www.orangehrm.com.